The fate of hundreds of the flood victims living in the camps located in schools across the country remains unknown a few hours to the schools are reopening on Monday. A majority of families claim they have not been given direction on alternative places to relocate to despite the directive by the government that they should be moved before learners return to school. The victims want the government to offer proper guidelines on their relocation strategy and to support them in dealing with the aftermath of the ravage floods. Safina Ching Oma now reports. Hours before the schools reopen on Monday, hundreds of displaced families are still stranded in schools which serve as rescue centers for flood victims. At St. Peter's Primary School in Narok Town, which hosts 120 families, we meet Caroline Selau, a mother of three. Despite having received the relocation notice from the government, Caroline, just like many others, insists that they have no place to go. The families occupying schools were supposed to relocate and pave way for learners to resume their second term of learning, a majority decrying the lack of resources and options to enable them to heed to this directive. Meanwhile, a section of leaders from the Rift Valley region have urged parents to exercise caution as they send their children back to school on Monday. Led by Senate Majority Leader Aaron Cheruyot, the leaders called upon parents to personally drop their children to school and assess the status of their safety. Ni vizuri watoto kuenda shule, lakini ni vizuri zaidi kuhakikisha kwamba barabara ile watoto wanapitia iko sawa kwanza kabla sisi kuruhusu watoto wetu kwenda shule. Pelekeni watoto shule mukikuwa wangalivu kwa barabara, kwa maji na kwa pale popota ambaye mnapita. And flood victims in Madare North got a relief after they received food donations from well wishers. The group under the Scrap Metal Council of Kenya at the government to fast track the process of assisting the vulnerable families. Tumenda Madare, Area 4, Tumenda Mabatini, Tumenda Uptown, Tumekuja Tukamalizia, Hapa Edquarter, Ya Uruma, Na Tunaeza Kuimiza, Wana Biashara Wote, Mutu Wote, Arejitole. The victims want the government to offer proper guidelines on their relocation strategy and to support them in dealing with the aftermath of the ravaging floods. Safina Ching Oma, Citizen TV.